We're here at Craft Alliance where we have two exhibitions, Amy Firestone Rosen and Tommy Simpson. When you first walk in, you'll see the work of Amy Firestone Rosen, who is a mixed media artist, and it is on display on the ceiling of the Creative Commons. A lot of my work has to do with feminism and the party dresses, and I wonder what women wear, and I go to places like Goodwill and estate sales, and I buy the most over-the-top party dresses that I can find that have wonderful textures that I know will translate into really interesting prints. And then I ink the dresses and I transfer that image and I make kind of a holographic print and I have digital images taken of the print. And once the image is digital, I can format it any way I want. They were originally conceived at the Foundry in St. Charles, which has a massive space and I envisioned a large sculpture to take up the space. The work of the Foundry was very large and flowy and I suppose a bit imposing because of the size of the work. And a I suppose a bit inviting because it was a soft fabric and then when it came to Craft Alliance it feels much more like an installation like a sailboat you feel like you're sailing through the room I love the way the softness of the fabric works against the industrial shapes of the space here and I'm really thrilled after looking at Amy Firestone Rosen's work dancing on the ceiling in our Creative Commons, you can step into the Steinberg Gallery to see Tommy Simpson's exhibition, Head, Heart, Hand. The exhibit is a mixed media show that I've done where the idea is to encourage people to involve themselves in their own self-worth and self-artfulness. The work of the show is a mixed media over a long period of time. I've been doing it for 63 years. There are some gouache paintings and three-dimensional sculpture. There's some furniture and some ceramics, a little bit of everything. Some of the work was made for clients, some were made for myself, some were just for fun to build. I always sort of treated the mixed media approach as like if you go to a meal, you just don't want to eat peas, you want salad and all kinds of other goodies. And so why only eat one thing? We're all capable of this artfulness in whatever activity you do, if you just allow yourself to do it. And so when you come to the exhibit, I hope it inspires you to give in to your own artfulness. It's in you, you just have to let yourself do it. Both of the artists on view at Craft Alliance are exploring creativity in lots of different ways, and that's why we wanted to also encourage everybody who visits to explore their own creativity. So we have a few different activities that will be set up free all the time in our Creative Commons here, and they will be for all ages, from kids to adults, and all of those things will be available for people who are visiting. We're so excited to feature these two artists on view at the Craft Alliance until March 18th. And for more information, please visit our website at craftalliance.org.